Question number 10, the Honourable Rick Mr. Barker. Uh, Mr. Speaker, my question is to the Minister for Arts, Culture and Heritage and asks, what is the status of the New Zealand Memorial Park project in Buckle Street, Wellington? The Mr. Honourable Speaker. Chris Finlayson. Yes, the project is in the planning stage. The New Zealand Transport Agency is working with both central and local government to investigate Memorial Park improvements and will be undertaking full public consultation as part of the Basin Reserve improvement investigations. This government is also taking the time to consult with Mount Cook School, the RSA and the local community, and this approach contrasts with that of the previous government, which wrote to Mount Cook School in August 2008 saying it didn't consider it appropriate for the school or the wider Mount Cook community to have any input into the decision-making process. The Honourable Rick Mr. Barker. Speaker, Mr Speaker, does the Minister accept that seeing what resembles an abandoned tip immediately after placing a flower on the tomb of the unknown warrior is a national disgrace? And what action is he taking to complete the work for a respectful memorial to those who gave their lives for this country. And now, Minister, is the right time to do the right thing. The Honourable Chris Finlayson. I agree with the member that it is uh, a national disgrace, and that is why last week, for example, when I was meeting with a representative from Mount Cook School, I was discussing some preparatory work like asphalt removal. I agree with what the member said, uh, that we have to get on with it, but as I've said before to that member, we're not going to do it in some half-baked manner. It's going to be done properly. Heke Parada. to the Minister. What reports has he seen about the development of Memorial Park? The Honourable Chris Finlayson. Yes, I've seen reports that the previous government said it was not appropriate for the local school uh, or the Mount Cook community to have input into the decision-making process. I've seen reports that the Labor candidate for Wellington Central in 2008, Grant Robertson, tried to get the uh, government to reconsider that decision but was told where to go. And I've seen correspondence stating that the ex-minister refused to sign off on the design and wanted to revisit options. Grant Robertson. Can the minister confirm that a design for the park that was acceptable to the Wellington City Council, central government and the local school was agreed late last year and that his reason for not taking that option up is simply, as he told one person, that he did not want to do something just because it was Helen Clark's idea. The Honourable Chris Finlayson. Well, that would be a very good reason not to do anything. anything that, but I, I can confirm that there was a plan. The plan is not acceptable. Further work needs to be done. Further consultation needs to be done. And it's going to be done. Point of order, Grant Robertson. Mr Speaker, I seek leave of the House to table Cabinet Minute 09 13 bar 8 bracket 62, which says that the Memorial Park project has been cancelled. Leave is sought to table that document. Is there any objection? There is no objection.